Sandy Brown spent six hours. Oh yeah, this is about seven inches from top to bottom. Trying to shave the excess weight on this Persian cat. And from what we can tell, um, our best guesstimate is she's probably never had a brush through her fur at all. She's about four years old. She's nothing but one big knot. So when you go and try to get a razor through that, you're literally trying to move almost like a boulder off the cat's body. You have to go a little bit at a time because if you can't just cut because her, she's so dehydrated that her skin is like elastic. Someone dropped the Persian cat off around noon Sunday at the Humane Society for Hamilton County. She had said that she had rescued it from a family member who could no longer care for it. In my eyes, she didn't have much of a life, but I still want to give her a chance. She just. It's not her fault. She's like that. She weighed four and a half pounds when she was brought in. One and a half of that weight was the fur she's been carrying for years. Feces and urine tangled in it. She had to be so uncomfortable. She was so skinny. I could tell she hasn't eaten or hasn't eaten very much in a long time. Her legs are the worst part. Um, we just got it off of her tail. People have been calling to help. Sandy will take her overnight to watch her. Monday morning, a professional groomer will finish what they started here today. We've named her Freedom, by the way, because we think that's apt, you know, an apt name for someone who's finally getting, a, getting to feel like what it should feel like for a cat um, for the first time in her life.